I want to make a point about caring. Caring isn't being the nice guy, the nice person, oh, really stroking and all that. Caring, part of it is loving those people, but part of love is demanding what? The best that they do. Not accepting anything less than their best. Making them accountable for their best performance. That's the key thing. Do you think it's good for somebody to let them slide? No. You're letting them get away and sooner or later, you know, they're going to go downhill. When I was at Young and Rubicam, I was, had just been promoted onto the biggest account they had. This was the biggest agency in the world, one of the biggest accounts, Procter & Gamble. I was one of the junior account execs and I was real excited. And the, and the guy calls me in for my first status meeting and I gave him a little status report that I had kind of written out and, you know, just general points. And, you know, I figured I was going to talk to him and I give him the piece of paper and this guy's name was Lang Martin. And Lang looks it up and he looks at this paper and he says, and he threw it in a basket. And I'm like, Ugh! and he said, you give me stuff like that, you're going back to the training department. He said, when you meet with me, it's got to be tough, together, right? I don't want to be guessing. I don't want to look at typos. I don't want to look at maybe this, maybe that. I want to tell you, it changed my life. It changed the way I acted. It really flipped me around. And I got promoted faster than anybody else onto top jobs there because I was really buttoned up unlike I am right now. But you know, that was the key. You have to demand the best from people. So you know, there's a balance. You know that whole expression, tough love, right? Tough love. You know, the problem is, for each of you and for me, all of us are either better at tough or better at love. Better at stroking or better at poking. How many of you are better stroking? How many better poking? How many ain't any good at anything? <laughs> no, but you have to find out. Like for me, I was always better at stroking, really getting a good guy. And I had to really work to get together as a leader and a coach to be tougher. So you want to get a balance. Same is true with your kids. You know, you want to get both. You want to be both. And that's a big part of motivation, a big part of leadership.